Uh, greetings and welcome to Final Fantasy 15. And also, apparently Ignis was staring at the wall for huh. some reason. So, last we left off, we made it into Altissia. Uh, it was a very long boat ride that I can't stand. And hope to never have to deal with ever again. Uh, gondolas. My only weakness. Which I don't really want to write them. How in the heck? Whoop. Well, there should be a real nice photo spot somewhere nearby. I bet there isn't. No. Save it for later. <sighs> yeah, whatever do you, Prompto. I am gonna go find my way over there. I'm probably gonna have to get a gondola. Which kind of sucks, cause. Ugh. I wonder. I really is she really gonna leave the army? You seem quite smitten with her. Which one is it? One is what? Her or Cindy? R and A or Cindy? Oh. Gondola. Care for a ride? Uh, I'm assuming I need to go here. Terrible camera angles. Wait, is the gondola motorized? Oh, it is. Which is weird because you can't really hear the engine. I can see the propeller in the back. Fantastic! Call when you need a ride back. Wow, what a terrible place for a bar. The building above you collapses, uh... Yeah, it's not gonna be good for all your patrons. Welcome to Accordo, lads. Sid mentioned you'd be dropping in. Wuskam Armor, as you've gathered. My word, you've grown, little prince. Hmm. Ah, uh, but of course. <laughs> you were only a babe at the time. Was I a hot babe? I know that's not the right context. Based on the still. government's actions, it would seem Accordo is supportive of the Oracle. Despite being under the Empire's thumb, therein Bruh. lies the riddle. What is, Lady is going Lufaya on? Truly safe. Ignis, what are you doing? So this is your maiden visit. Enjoying it so far? You doubtless have many questions, so ask away. This country is a part of the Empire, isn't it? Oh, I think the bigger wary. question is, why you is understand. Ignis right in front of the There's camera? There's no need to jump at every shadow. Just be aware that the terms of our independence grant the Empire free reign to come and go as they please. We'll bear that in mind. It's admittedly a one-sided arrangement. Most everything we do wow. requires Niflheim's permission. This is such a great camera angle. And they angle. wouldn't knowingly permit the Oracle show. to appear before the I public. I just get to see the back of Ignis. How our Ignis. government spun that is quite a mystery bell ringing um is there anything to ask about the oracle empire nah that's all no nah, i don't need to hear anything about you we're good for now well if you need anything else i you don't know need information where to find i need thanks appreciate it answers oh, my dear camellia it's been a while that doesn't make any sense i heard about your distinguished guests ah you've an ear for gossip Okay. And you are? Gentlemen, I won't waste your time. My name is Camellia Clostra. First Secretary of the Accordo Protectorate. You should know, we have Lady Luna Freya in our care. And the Empire demands we surrender her. What? Yet I am loath to acquiesce unless we stand to profit. Hence I've come to discuss terms with the King of Lucis. If you've a mind to talk, come to my estate. Mm, but you said you don't want to give her up without profit. That's she a problem. She can be oblique at the best of times. But I assure you, her heart is in the right place. Oh, okay. At any rate, you must be weary from your journey. Might I suggest you seek your beds for now and ponder matters anew in the morning? Yeah, I think we'll do just that. 
Whatever you say, black guy. <laughs> Splendid. Where are we off to? Uh, let's see. I think at this point, I need to go here. I have no idea where to go when it comes to... Like, where I need, you know, where to find a place to stay. I am definitely going to skip this now. Because that's going to take way too long. Gentlemen, it has been a pleasure. No, it hasn't. Oh, found the place to stay, I guess. You see this, Noct? What about it? Uh, I no. Stay tonight. I don't see anything. Uh, what's this? So, touring the town, see your famous gondola. Blah. How about a ride on the gondola? Let's head back I mean, to we our just room. did. Oh. Tiana. Ahead lies a future uncertain, God, yet sure is the astral memory, wherein the king may walk. Whatever you say, lady. How dare you casually pet God Duggo. Through Umbra's power, you can now revisit past memories. Summon him when you rest at lodgings. Characters will retain their current level and abilities. Rental chocobos will automatically return to the post. The place you called... The place you called Umbra... That was... I don't know why I was going to say that sentence in a weird way. Will be set as your last rest point. Interesting. Can now sail the open seas in the royal vessel. Board the boat from Gondokwa, Cape Calm, or Atisia. Ah, uh, okay. So basically we have free reign to go wherever we want now. Interesting. I just want to go to bed, though. Wait, what the frick? The summit? Hmm, okay. Greetings. No. Oh my gosh, I'm broke! Very well. I can't spend a night here, but I have well, to. Guess we need to go talk to Camellia. Yeah, like we have any other option. There's no telling how events will unfold. Let us prepare before making our way. Yeah, she can sit tight a while. Maybe we can just go over there? I think we can just go over here. What an overly complicated place to live in. Absorb. Oh. Weird. There's just magic lying around here in containers. Oh. They should, uh... Be more careful about that. It's dark. Is it evening already? Time flies when you're having fun. Once the negotiations begin, you'll be unable to return to the city. Are you certain you wish to continue? Yes. Negotiations! Man, what great negotiations when no one's talking. At least we can't hear them talking. Thank you for coming. Mm, you're not welcome. You got a lot of books there. Are any of them Lore of the Endowment? Link in the description below. Are they sequels? I did not approve of that. The negotiation is about to begin with First Secretary Kalistra. 
engage her in a manner briefing of a king and strive to win her trust and cooperation. But I don't wanna. No sweat. First things first. Or, uh, pry into private affairs. <laughs> Express gratitude. Pry into private affairs. <laughs> Are you and Westcombe lovers? If you want gossip, go to a cafe. I, for one, am here for business. Though circumstances have changed, both the King and the Oracle are finally in Altitia. You said that you have Luna in your care. Demand to see her. <laughs> I want to see her now. So hasty. Surely you can spare a moment to talk. No, I can't. Now, let me ask some questions of my own. Why does the Oracle seek to awaken the Hydrian? Uh, tell her nothing. Doesn't matter why she's doing this. So the Oracle can do as she pleases. A precarious attitude to take before God. Let me be frank. The potential chaos worries me. You know better than most what took place in Lucis with Archeon. Tell me, what happened? Uh, be cheeky. The big guy woke up and went on a trip. Really? A mild way to put it. It will most likely come to war. However, I don't care to host a battle on my soil. The gods and the Empire be damned. Uh, watch your mouth. Uh, be realistic. Went to a common enemy, show concern for the city. Yeah, be realistic. Not much you can do when it comes to gods. You'd suggest I accept my city's destruction? Yes. Hold, be positive, be pragmatic. Withhold. Must be negative as possible. Um... Nothing of worth to contribute? Without further ado, let us talk terms. If you wish to hold the right, you must ensure my citizens' safety and aid in their evacuation. No. Uh, apathy, agree, suggest further measures. Apathy! Nah, can't be bothered. <laughs> Come now, we both know you want the right. I will pretend that was a joke. And that is not all. Once the right has begun, I will not be accountable for what follows. You are on your own. Uh, act displeased, confident, worried, displeased. You're basically telling us to fight the Empire alone. In a manner of speaking, but to rephrase it from our perspective, Accordo has no troops that can aid you. Not amid such chaos at any rate. That is all for the terms. To review, you are to ensure our citizens' safety and engage the Empire. Do we have an agreement? Uh... Respond promptly. Pompous. Just to be clear, we're doing you a favor. <laughs> a final warning, though I doubt it'll come to it. My duty is to my citizens. Should any harm befall them, there will be a reckoning for both King and Oracle. Uh, <laughs> return the threat. There'll be a reckoning for you, too. A leader must know when to bring out the steel. Surely you understand this. Press subject, show understanding, put up a strong front. There won't be any casualties. Again, you intrigue me. Oh, well, that's not what you I expected You and your father are cut from different cloths. I wonder what manner of king you'll make. Madam, it's time. Assign three of your own for the evacuation effort. Whom you choose is up to you. According to our intel, the Imperial fleet will be four warships strong. Steal yourselves for a full-scale battle. This meeting didn't instill me with confidence, but we must make do. <laughs> <laughs> Noctis somehow managed to secure terms. I mean, I almost kind of tried to sabotage it, if you think about it. But whatever. I'm surprised it went through. There probably isn't a way to actually fail that, as far as I know. Uh, I almost have 69,000 XP. 
which I can't use because uh, reasons. I can't I can. promise something I can't help. Of course. You certainly opened up to them, though. What can I say? I have a soft spot for the young and tragic. Gross? They've lost Regis. They've lost the crystal. Was it so long ago the last oracle was taken from them? We've seen the Empire go mad these ten odd years. Mm. Interesting. The day of the right. What about the day of the wrong? Okay. On a gondola. How do you During manage right, to use we this must gondola? See to it. The Empire does not harass Leviathan. Gonna be tough to pull off yeah, before the king thing, receives actually. your power. And with three of us on evacuation detail. Indeed. The best we can realistically do is to help the Hydrian help herself. What kind of help are you talking about? Just like Titan, the Empire will seek to immobilize Leviathan. Oh, with the harpoon things? If we can dislodge them from the goddess, she will have a fighting chance. Sounds good in theory, but don't push it. It's pointless, unless you can get that blessing. Stay flexible, stay alert. All right, will do. Like, is there a way for the gondola to do a U-turn? That's the thing that qu that I question. Like, how does it manage to go in this direction? Okay, we're just gonna go to a loading screen. Whatever. Little Freya knocks uh, Florette. Oh, knock this little Freya. I've not met. If oh, worse comes to okay. worse, you can threaten to throw the trident into the sea. Then they'll listen. In the meantime, it will be well guarded. Better than the Oracle herself. Understood. I shall reclaim it at the altar. Remember, you'll be under Imperial Watch. Right. Think of it as a necessary evil in order to forge the Covenant. I am in your debt. Okay. Once it's over, you may go as you please. But you do so without our protection. So be it. You'd better get going. Your public is waiting for you. Wow, they were quick to show up. Face. Stupid people. No, they're not even really people from uh, from what we've learned from fighting them in their bases. They're technically diamonds? So, mm, weird. Knocked. You in position? Yep. Don't nope. forget the plan. You guys too? Of course. Mm. Right, it's kind of weird that they have just three people helping an entire <sighs> city evacuate. Crowd. Look, the whole city's come to watch. Uh, can I get anywhere close? No. Okay. Guess I'll just stand here. I think there was a graphical error there for a moment. I didn't even really notice it. Dear friends, I uh, stand hey, I'm not before your friend. you today. With little hope, the words I speak shall reach 
beyond these walls. For slowly, but surely, the light fades from our world, and as it does, the shadows shall loom ever longer until all succumbs to the darkness. Darkness that evokes terror, hatred, and sorrow in the hearts of men. That's definitely a beasting for you. The ashes of Lucis. A dream of peace, twisted into a nightmare of death and destruction, claiming innumerable lives and leaving myriad souls to suffer. Luna. Yet I beg you, do not surrender to despair. Have faith, for our gods watch over us. By their blessings, by the stars that light the heavens above, our world will be delivered from the perils of the dark. It's going to take I two decades, though. I stand before you here in Altitia to call upon Leviathan, goddess of the seas, spirit of the deep. By the sacred rite, I will commune with the Hydrian. But first, I offer you my solemn vow. On my honor as Oracle, I will not rest until the darkness is banished from our world and the light is restored. It's gonna take you two decades. Bless you all. Ah, uh, Nakash, you big crybaby. That was a terrible speech. <laughs> no one's gonna question that Noctis is standing in the middle of the crowd. My phone! Ha. Thought I'd put this on silent. Knocked. The Umpire's here. I can see him. Dropships are closing in on the port. I thought there was supposed to be four of them. Okay. That's way more than four. We got him covered. So, it begins. Covenants. Ugh. Yawn. Platform to nothing? Man, for a girl in a white dress, she moves fast. Oh, apparently she's also singing, which is weird, because... can't really hear it. It is I, Luna Freya, blood of the Oracle. Goddess of the seas, I beseech you, enter into this covenant that the king might reclaim the stone. Likely. Time to lend the Hydrian a hand. Ooh. No. She's gonna run. Let's Point work. Let's do this. Bye. I know 
what you must know. That the King of Kings is to drive the darkness from our star. It is in receiving mercy that men offer praise, and in shedding grace that the gods solicit worship. Finding this baby. The moment I saw her, I knew we'd go places. Not again. Not making this easy. Not. Hold on tight. So the only way you'll help me is if I take you down? I mean... Hey! I fell.
version. Myself? I can't. Well, no, I can't. Girl, you need to chill. Trying to warp over there. Oh, yeah. Game, give me the warp point. Thank you. My gosh. Problems all of a sudden. Oh. Now, oh. about that ring. On second thought, you let him have it. Ow. Oh. There's the evil. And do remind him about the crystal. <laughs> Oh, Prince, your bride awaits! I will pass the ring to the rightful king. When the prophecy is fulfilled, all enthralled to darkness, Shall know peace. Man, you got pissy all of a sudden. Never trust a man in a scarf. How oh, sweet. But please, Lady Luna Freya. You first. What's the point of that then?
go to any of the tombs. Uh. I can just gain all of them. <laughs> yeah, I think we're back. Time for you to get smacked. I would assume that having the power of the king just would make you all powerful. Yeah. There is not a thing she can do now. up actually. The fact that basically just beating her up at you know. to uh, force her to surrender. So I just realized I have like 4,000 now. I just magically have more health. Explosions! Oh, she's making multi copy. Ow, ow, ow. Water copies are pissing me off. Stop being annoying for like two She's getting absolutely destroyed. It isn't really even a fight at this point. Where is she? Oh, she summoned uh, Typhoon. Ow. Tsunamis. Water tornadoes. You out. Oh. I win. Oh. Butt mashing. I wasn't expecting the butt mash.
I just slit the dragon's throat. It's kind of dark. It's done. You sure about that? Okay, well, that was a lot of destruction. I don't think anyone survived that. Noctis? Uh, uh, Luna? Ah, children of the corn. So, you found your way here. <laughs> and you found me. A chance to see you once more. Who would have thought? Well, what do you mean? What, is this Why the far plane? you see me? Because my prayers have been answered. My calling fulfilled. But Your white hair became whiter? That doesn't have to come between us. You are the one, Noctis. The stars shine for you now. That which is yours by right shall be restored to you. Do you remember the flowers of Tenebrae? It seems so long ago. You'll find they await you still, blooming from hill to vale. Will you be there? Ah, it's because she's going to become a goth now. Would that I could join you. But this moment will have to be enough. It's not right. All I... All I wanted was to save you. How selfish. Wanting to save a girl. When the world falls down around you and hope is lost. When you find yourself alone amid a lightless place. Look to the distance. Know that I am there. And that I watch over you always. Dear Noctis. I feel like you're lying. You <laughs> killed that flower. <laughs> also, those aren't the clothes I'm wearing. At least I got a nice ring out of it. Back with us. I'll tell the others. 
Though it may take a bit. You're hurt. A oh, small sacrifice in the greater battle. And Luna? She has passed. <gasps> I'll never have left that for you. God Doggo left book. <sighs> It's supposed to be a sad moment and all, but I can't help question why that had to happen in general. Uh, and we can all chalk it up to the writer, just being the writer, but still. It seemed highly unnecessary that the Oracle had to uh, pass in order for the king to gain his throne, which he hasn't really gained his throne yet. All he did was get the ring that proves his worthiness to the throne. Also, they're all wearing the wrong clothes. Not supposed to be wearing those clothes. I'm gonna make sure to, uh, refit everybody for their specific gear. Cause they're kinda pissing me off with changing stuff around. Without, uh, my acknowledgement. Yeah. Trials of Ice and Complete. Ark of the Hydrian. Which we will never get to use. Because, uh... For whatever reason, we can't just summon the gods at will. Ah. Pictures. Useless pictures. Ah, the last time we ever get to see Ignis with eyes. Anyways. Ah. Black guy. White woman. More Ignis. More Ignis. And more Ignis. Wow. Propner really likes taking pictures of Ignis. It's kind of, uh... Kind of weird. How did you get that picture of all pictures? Hmm. Weird. Also, are there barnacles in her mouth? That's disgusting. Chapter 10, The Heart of a King. Uh, across the water onto the rails, the royal retinue makes for... Ah, man. So many words. So much English. Well, it's technically Japanese being translated to English, so... I guess I can see why it would be hard to understand. Galea, the imperial capital. Oh, so this this is where we're basically just stuck going uh through the main story. We cannot go back, basically. That's fine though. I don't need to go get anything anyways. Just gotta go uh beat up the Empire now. The Scourge of the Stars. Several weeks later. Train! Okay. Oh, at least I'm back in my suit so, now. We're gonna roll through Tenebrae. Not before visiting the royal tomb at Cartanico. Oh, uh, you're sure you're up to that? The wounds have mended. I sign some matter of time. Mm. Sure about that? That's 
wrong with you? Hey, watch your mouth. What? We're not stopping in Tenebrae. You need to grow up and get over it. I am over it. I'm here, aren't I? Maybe when you're not too busy moping, you can look around and give a shit at someone worse off than you. Let go of me. Calm down, that ring man. You, you rather carry it around than wear it? She gave her life so you could do your duty. Not so you could sit around feeling sorry for yourself. You don't think I know you that? You don't! Ignis took one for you, too. And for what? Enough, Gladio. You think you're a king, but you're a coward. Shut up! Don't do this! I... Man. I get it, all right? I get it! Then get a grip. Pull your head out of your ass already. Man, Gladio, you're just full of terrible words today. Knocked! Leave him. Which is weird because he's the one that's been spouting all the nonsense of being the king's shield and that they have to be brothers and, you know, that they need to make sure that he's, you know, not to stays on his path to what he's been called for. But right then and there, all of a sudden, he's just like, nah, I'm going to forget all that and torture him for no reason. Tell him he's a little prick. Messed up. This doesn't sound right. Not just free to roam about the train until it pulls into the station. Uh, but what if I don't wanna? Uh, can I? Okay, I was gonna say. Can I work on a uh, gear? Because Gladio is not wearing what he's supposed to be wearing. Because he's a douche. The casual. Actually, you know what? Let's change it up. Now that we're, uh, basically on rails for the next few chapters, we can wear. Different stuff. I don't like the casual for Noctis, unfortunately. Uh. No, nah, I don't want to be Mexican. What is he at? Hmm. Special shoe recovered and repurposed by Sid. He uses Magitech energy to generate a barrier that wards the wearer from harm. That sounds like it's cheating, though. Yeah, it cheating, so we're not gonna use it. Poor Ignis. All right, that works. Feel like I got taller all of a sudden. Oh, I'm gonna go this way for no reason. No. Well, I guess I'm not going this way for no reason. Thing over here. Uh, we're almost there. Uh, okay. There's men in black are spooking me out. Men in black? Does she mean don't talk about others? Ones who hunt down aliens? Check. What can I check? Merchant stop, merchant use only? Hmm. But why can I check it though? He thinks that I can do something about that. I if I were to just hit the button automatically for no reason. Oh, I thought that was Gladio for a moment. How much longer? Not why am I walking down the end of the train? Oh, there he is. That's why I was walking down the end of the train. What if I continue to walk down the end of the train? Hmm. Stealth going on? No. Oh. I know this, uh, this car. 
This is where the people who go to Hogwarts sit. I saw the way you were looking at her. I wasn't looking at anyone. No. Oh. He was definitely looking at someone. What's this? That's useless. Oh, found the bar. Don't oh, keep on walking. Grab that. That's also useless. Battle of Distinction. Hmm. Oh, can't go that way. Cleaning in progress. Well, what a grand waste of time. Although I guess I should technically not train. I should technically end the session because at this point. Um, yeah, we basically got nothing else to do. Don't really need to go anywhere. So, uh, that being said, that'll be the end of today's session. So, thank you all for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Stay safe, take care. We'll see you in the next session.